Andamana nasi mtazamaji hadi tamati mtangazaji wetu wa ishara ni Brian Muraru. Waumini wa Kikristo kote nchini walijiunga na ulimwengu katika kuadhimisha Ijumaa kuu huku mito ikitolewa kwa serikali kushughulikia changamoto zinazowakabili wa Kenya. Mzigo wa ushuru mgomo wa madaktari unaelelea pamoja na madai ya mbolea bandia ni miongoni mwa masuala ambayo wa Kenya wanataka yashughulikiwe haraka iwezekanavyo. Viongozi wa kidini wakiongozwa na askofu mkuu wa kanisa katoliki jijini Nairobi Philip Anyono pamoja na mwenzake wa kianglikana Joseph Olesapit pia walitoa wito kwa umoja wa miongoni mwa Kenya kwa, kwa wa Kenya wote. Waumini wa Kristo kote nchini walianza kuadhimisha sherehe za msimu wa Pasaka leo. Huku umamia ya waumini wa kanisa katoliki la Holy Family Basilica jijini Nairobi wakidhirisha njia ya msalaba msafara wa amani ili kuadhimisha shauku ya Kristo ukumbushwe kusulubishwa kwa Yesu Msafara uliodumu kwa muda mrefu uliwawezesha wa Kristo kufanya matembezi katika barabara mbalimbali jijini Nairobi akiongea wakati wa msafara huo askofu mkuu wa kanisa katoliki jijini Nairobi Philip Anyolo alitoa wito kwa serikali kushauriana na madaktari wanaogoma haraka iwezekanavyo we request that the government and all leaders in these areas should always enter into dialogue and discuss so that we don't end up with strikes we don't end up with the people dying siku hii pia iliadhimishwa na ibada ya kanisa katika kanisa la All Saints Cathedral ikiongozwa na askofu mkuu wa kanisa la kianglikana Jackson Olesapit It's a day of liberation and a day where we also speak liberation to any situation in our lives today that is holding us uh, that is weighing us down uh, such as uh, the high cost of living in this country 40 days was very interesting so many Christians were able to discern themselves Joseph Wahungu Darubini weekend